over to Walmart our, to get another car. Our studio manager just like <laughs> took him off. And it's like 10 minute limit. Nope. No. <laughs> Yeah, that's just weird how that happens sometimes when you get like a bad. I, I've had rare, rare occasions, you know, I, off the air where I've had, you know, people with bad phones and they have to hook up the landlines. I, yeah. I, I hear weird stuff like that, like a coast to coast banner. <laughs> was it the other night I was listening to this one dude, he just got on there and he goes, Coca Cola. <laughs> and George Story is like, what? <laughs> okay, then on to the next caller. I was like, yellow. Yeah, they're <laughs> wigging it. You know, you gotta love it, man. And that's no. what that's what we had to do tonight. Yeah. And, and, and I think we 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 did what we had to do. And we came out. Well, hey, at least everyone good. knows that we have connections. You know, that was the real DDP, by the way, everybody. Yeah. That no was my brother person. Johnny. Yeah, right? yeah, 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 yeah. Johnny, Johnny P. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I gave him five bucks. Man. Yeah. It's like, hey, dude, you, do you gotta cover this interview. <laughs> Hey, bro. <laughs> yeah. Bang. I'll bring you over some food tomorrow, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I promise it'll yeah. be the best time ever. <laughs> well, guys, uh, we got Thanksgiving coming up. Oh, yeah. yeah. After that, we got another edition of the show. I'm working on, a, I got a couple of uh, pre recorded phoners uh, I'm in the works, uh, in the works of uh, finalizing here cool. for next week. Uh of course, we're going to be talking with, if everything's uh, right uh, in the world, we got Tommy James from Tommy James and the Shondells. He put out a great autobiography this year. I want to have him on the air. We had a couple of chances to talk, but you know how things happen in, in the business. We weren't able to connect. And no, it didn't have anything to do with the phone right away. <laughs> but, yeah, we were going to talk. But, yeah, he's going to be on the show in the pre-record. We're also going to remember John Lennon, uh, December 8th, I do believe, 7th or 8th. I think it's the 8th. Will be the 30th anniversary of his untimely passing. Uh, his murder. Oh yeah. We're gonna have on a guy who was real close to John during the 1970s, both in, mostly in New York, but he was with for a spell and during John's last weekend on the West Coast. Uh, an acclaimed rock photographer. If you're gonna talk about rock photographers, this guy is, if not number one, he's number two. Uh, cool. Bob Gruen will be coming on the show, and next week we're gonna get into a holiday way with the sounds. And uh, I guess just the sheer suaveness of a great radio guy, great online guy, Mr. Red Peters. Is cool. With, yes, he's going to be bringing in uh, a couple of radio-friendly tracks for us. Oh wow! And we're gonna uh, we're gonna listen to some holiday music. I, I, he sent me a couple of tracks a couple of weeks ago. I wasn't. I, I kept my word. I didn't leak them out. They were yet to be fully released to the public. He, he put that much faith in me. So <laughs> Red Peters is coming on next week. Oh, that's pretty fun. Man, it's going to be a stellar show. And I'm working on some uh, interviews for the month of December with a couple of comedians, Ooh. potentially. Hey, all right. I don't want to say anything because I don't want to blow it. Yeah. It, the last thing I want to do is blow it. I mean, look how look how bad we felt about that the bad phone. Yeah. yeah. It wasn't even ours. 